hello everyone welcome to my youtube channel and today we are going to another olympiad question this question is based on algebra x square minus x cube equals to 12 so first of all this is the equation and here we need to find the value of x so this is the equation so here first of all this 12 goes to left hand side so its sign will be negative and right hand side is 0. Now you can see x square minus x cube this 12 become negative. Now we will break this 12 minus 12 in two parts minus 8 and minus 4. So can we write this 8 2 cube and this 4 2 square and right hand side remains 0 as well as. Then next you can see this x square term and this is also x square term square term 2 square and x square so we will combine these two terms and rest the cubic term are x cube and minus 2 cube we will write these two cubic term together and these two square term together and here you can see x square minus uh, 2 square so this is the identity of a square minus b square and here a cube minus b cube, b cube identity we will apply. So for this first of all we will common here minus sign. Minus is common so x cube and plus 2 cube. So minus sign is common so this, uh, this will become positive it is also positive. And here both are the negative. So we are using here two identities a square minus b square and a cube plus b cube. a square minus b square identity says a plus b a minus b. And a cube plus b cube identity says a plus b a square minus a b plus b square. These two are identity we are using in these two terms. First term is x square minus 2 square it means a square minus b square so we are using this identity for the these two terms a plus b and a minus b so x plus 2 and x minus 2 and for this we are using this identity this identity is a cube plus b cube is a plus b a plus b here our a is x and b is 2 so x plus 2 a plus b Okay, uh, this, uh, this one is A and this one is B. A plus B and remaining is A square. A square means X square. Minus AB. Minus AB means X into 2. X into 2. Plus B square. B square means 2 square. Now next, you can see here the sign in these two terms and these two terms. Here the sign in between is negative. So do not forget to put this negative sign. And after negative sign, there are two terms. Two, uh, this, this is the binomial term and this is the trinomial term. So we can use a bracket, curly bracket, so that uh, this sign negative can visible easily. Now you can see x plus 2 and x plus 2 is common in this full term. In this full expression, x plus 2 is the common. So we'll take out x plus 2 common. And inside is x minus 2 and negative sign is as it is and this one is x square x into 2 is 2x and this 2 square can we write 4 okay now you can see x plus 2 outside remains same this x plus 2 is remain same and you can see we will solve this expression x and 2x they are like term so we will add these x and 2x will become 3x and minus 2 and minus 4 both are the negative minus minus plus and 2 and 4 is minus 6 and minus x square is there is no like term of the x square so we will write this minus x square as it is okay and you can see here the right hand side 0 so we will write in each step do not forget to write the equal to 0. Okay. Now you can see there are two 
terms which is two expressions x plus 2 and this one so can we write this x plus 2 equal to 0 and this uh, full expression equal to 0 1 by 1 so you can see here x plus 2 is equal to 0 this one is equal to 0 and this one is also equal to 0 so we will write this 3x minus 6 minus x square equal to 0 okay so here the value of x is minus 2 first value will get easily but the second one you can see the quadratic equation here minus x square 3x minus 6 can we write in systematic form in a standard form of the quadratic equation minus x square then plus 3x then minus 6 equals to 0 and take out the minus sign common so it is positive it is negative and it is positive and this minus sign goes right hand side 0 so only remaining part is x square minus 3x plus 6 equal to 0 minus sign is goes 0 side so it will also 0 now we have this term so how to solve this expression by the quadratic formula everybody knows the quadratic formula in the 10th class so the quadratic formula is x equals to minus b plus minus under root of b square minus 4ac upon 2a this is the quadratic formula and apply this quadratic formula here minus b your if you compare this term by the standard form of the quadratic equation so you'll get the value of a b c a value the coefficient of x square is your a a is 1 and b is here minus 3 and c is 6 okay so uh, your minus b here is the minus b and but the b value is already in minus 3 so can we write this minus sign and b value is minus 3 so we will write minus 3 plus minus under root of b square b square means minus 3 square minus 4 a a means 1 and c means 6 a is 1 and c is 6 okay and the denominator is the 2 a 2 a divide me divide is the 2 a 2 into a a is the 1 so x value is minus minus plus which is 3 plus minus under root of minus 3 square is the 9 and 4 6 are 24 4 6 are 24 into 1 is 24 2 ones are 2 then uh, equal to 3 plus minus 24 minus 9 it will uh, minus 15 and 2 this minus under root of minus value will become a iota everybody knows this minus 1 value is the iota okay so can we write this minus root of minus value is iota and this 15 is outside so too now x value is there are two values of x x equals to 3 plus minus 15 iota by 2 you can see iota 15 or 15 iota both are the same so x value is 3 we will take the plus value first 3 plus 15 iota by 2 and then another negative value is x equals to 3 minus 15 i by 2 and already we will find x equals to minus 2 this is also the value of minus 2 so you can see this is this is this is the equation of x square minus x cube here the highest degree is 3 so it means the value of x are three values of x first value is minus 2 second value is this one and the third value is this one if you like this video please like share and subscribe my channel thank you and thanks for watching